Jimbo Dutch here with another brand new tutorial. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm really sorry because um, I've been busy with other stuff. Uh, what have I been doing? Ah, I created some uh, some other game, which was pr pretty, pretty awesome, I think. Let me just show you real quick. I hope, real quick. So anyway, um, welcome guys to a brand new tutorial, how to create Minecraft 2D. I hope uh, this will be some... Um, oh wait, no, this is the wrong file. Never mind, never mind. It's a slide game where you um, you just slide with a block. It's a kind of puzzle thing. But anyway, um, let's get to the Minecraft stuff right now. Uh, so what we are going to do today is some crafting. And what we are going to craft are tools. And wow, that was some work, man. Absolutely. Uh, because you have to go to items here, to the sprites, and add all these things. Five per category, a gold, diamond, iron, stone, and wood. Uh, after you did that, you gotta have some uh, some sprites for your uh, inventory slots, because these sprites here are just way too small. So, you will have... Uh, 25 extra sprites. Uh, in order to make iron and di uh, yeah, I, in order to make iron and gold, you will need ignits. Iron and gold ign in, in what's like ign ignits? I don't know. I'm not sure if I pronounce it well. Anyway, uh, after you did that, you gotta go to control. Then not here, but to object slot. You gotta add all these stuff you know all this stuff and give them nice numbers not too difficult don't make it too, too hard on yourself too difficult for yourself and then we are going to CT1 where we have the ability to create wood planks and stuff like that also sticks torches crafting table and this is where the fun starts the rest of the script is all tools tools only so wooden sword, shovel, pickaxe, axes, hoe, and then we got wood, stone, iron, diamond, and gold. So that was some some work, man. Jeez. And let's see. After you did that, you gotta add this here. I think we already got something like it, but you gotta give them r the right number. So it's like 21. Where's my uh, wooden sword and 52 is my golden hoe. Uh, between 21 and 45 we have all our um, tools. Yeah. You gotta make sure uh, like um, you can't hold more than two tools, uh, more than one tool, I'm sorry, in one slot. That's the thing I, we gotta fix though because um, when you craft a tool Everything's cool. But when you pick up one tool and you combine it with the other in one slot, there will still be two tools. But we can fix that real quick, so uh, we're gonna do that. So let me create a crafting table, some sticks, and this is what I meant. So we have one pickaxe now here, and we get one more. And then we can combine them. Oh, we can't. Wait, I already fixed it. So that that's the thing I didn't fix. I thought I didn't fix, but I already did that. Uh, wow, the amount of work I had to do to achieve this was incredible, incredibly least a lot. I'm sorry. Um, I also improved our generation script for uh, every ore stuff like that. That is also a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. Too much to do in a tutorial. And uh, since you guys all ask for download files, stuff like that, I will probably make this downloadable. So you can uh, experimentate with everything and be happy. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, what I also did was uh, after we created tools, 
we are gonna manipulate the hardness of the uh, of every block, you know. So this is say uh, the number of the uh, wooden pickaxe and stone. I think this is iron, diamond, and gold, and it will improve um, the mining speed. So here you can see that the hardness is 77 and a half, but when you have a wooden pickaxe, that time is already like six times, seven times almost uh, faster, which is uh, pretty helpful. Uh, also, what I did is I created a drop variable, and here you can see that drop is true 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 but that is only true but it is only true when you have actually a pickaxe selected when you have anything else selected then the drop variable will be false and what happens then well if we go to the break object and we go to alarm we can see that if only if drop is true it will create an item otherwise you will just uh, remove the block and nothing else will happen and I did that with a lot of uh, objects, uh, except of course uh, wood and grass and sand and cactus. Um, it, it's like it's like the the real Minecraft where you can where you can't mine stone with your bare hands, stuff like that. You know, it's basic basic stuff. Uh, you can't mine diamond ores uh, unless you have a a iron pickaxe or higher. You know, stuff like that. Um, yeah, you can you can see that actually here. Uh, here, uh, wooden pickaxe, stone pickaxe, drop variables false. Uh, hardness will still be 15. See, and uh, same with gold. When you have a gold pickaxe, you can't mine diamond ore, uh, so the drop variable will, will be false, and the hardness will still be 15. But if you have like a diamond pickaxe or an iron pickaxe, you can mine it, and it will be pretty fast. So yeah, uh, what else did I do? What else did I do? Oh yeah, when you hover a slot in your uh, inventory and uh, with your mouse, I mean, then a nice box will appear, um, like like this, you know. And it, will, it will follow the mouse uh, mouse his position, and um, yeah, it gives a nice effect. The I, I think Minecraft has it as well. Yeah. Minecraft has as well, definitely. Um, yeah. Wow. Uh, oh no, it lags. Well, luckily I saved. Uh. Alright. I don't know if, it, if 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 it's part twenty one uh, twenty six uh, maybe we are at twenty seven right now I don't know but uh, let me check that later uh, let let me see what else did I do oh yeah with the uh, with the hand of Steve I added a lot of uh, uh, images in step event no uh, not, not the hand is the hand yes yeah, it's, it's the hand right. Um, uh, here, of course, every, every object, basically, and uh, in the next, uh, real tutorial, because this was just a show off, um, but in the next tutorial, I will, uh, give a tutorial about how to make chests and furnaces, because, uh, we can't make, uh, ingots, ignits, stuff like that, we can't make gold or iron, we can't melt it in, uh, the furnace, so we gotta do that. And if we have all these items, we have a place to store them, the chest. And it works. I already have some uh, something going. Um, I can show you. This is like my main file where I uh, have everything going. Okay, so I created some chests. Let me uh, drop some all coal. Coal. I'm sorry. Didn't know what to say there. And we can see we have some uh, some storages here. Now um, I want to melt something, and therefore I need some coal. So I'm gonna go here, here, 
gonna get a press and go or wow that didn't work way way there's definitely something wrong there <laughs> that is incredible you know oh what what did what what hang on a second Why does this one work and the other one doesn't? Let me place another one. Oh wait. <laughs> oh I don't I don't have uh, anything anymore. Right. So <laughs> There are some some bugs here, but eventually we have some uh, iron in the ignite stuff like that. I don't know how to pronounce this yet. Uh, so yeah, I think I will be going that right now. So we'll see you guys later. Uh, enjoy the files, by the way, and I hope you can continue your journey to a perfect Minecraft studio. See you guys later.